Howdy, Mojave D here. I am doing well. I hope you are doing well. I would like to announce the winners of the free Baldur's Gate 3 giveaway. They are KD and Noxio7. KD, that is spelled capital K-A-Y, capital D. Congratulations. And Noxio7 is spelled N-O-X-I-O-7. Congratulations to both of you. And thank everybody. I want to thank everybody. Thanks to everybody who, uh, who, who entered and who commented and watched uh, episode 2 of Bladdergate 3. Baldergate. Baldersgate. <clears throat> Got a, I got to quit calling it Bladders Gate. They're going to hate me. I hope they have a sense of humor. I hope the developers over at Baldur's Gate 3 have a sense of humor. Um, but thank you all. Um, it, it's, it, I really appreciate it. And the only thing I hate about doing giveaways is that I can't buy the game for everybody who uh, who wanted it. It's for I, I, that, I hate that. I really do. It's like, my heart, my heart wants to say, uh, "Hey, man, you know, give the game to everybody." Uh, but my brain says, "Hey, man, you're not Oprah Winfrey. You don't have Oprah Winfrey money. You can't do that, son. You, you gotta buy food, dude." <laughs> so, you know, I, I, I truly wish I could. Um, but thank you all. Uh, we're going to get into episode three here of Balder. Baldur's Gate 3. It's really, I just keep wanting to switch the L and the A. Um, sorry about that. <laughs> Developers, I'm not doing it on purpose. Uh, well, sometimes I am, just because it's funny. Um, we left off, I, I wrote my notes down here. We, we, um, um, well, we beat the guy, what was his name? Uh, Zelk, or Zalk, or Zelk. Uh, and got his sword. Lazel has his sword. Lazel also crashed the naughty Larry, la, naughty Lloyd um, ship, right? We were trying to get to the helm. We got to the helm, but Lazel crashed the darn thing on the beach. Anyway, so we, uh, we went around and we found everybody, plus two new people. We found Shadowheart. We found, we eventually found Lazel. It was, she was captured or she stepped in a trap a, a, a goblin trap or something and there's a couple of uh, what are those things called I wrote I wrote notes um, uh, uh, tieflings uh, had, <laughs> were wondering what they were going to do with her um, but we found Shadowheart we found Lazelle and we found two new people Gail and the vampire dude um, uh, what's his name <laughs> can't think of his name right now and the, so we found the vampire, and we found, I think Gail is a wizard, uh, and so they're with us, and then made camp. We also found out from Lazel, uh, Lazel's the only one with a plan. She has a plan for getting that dang uh, parasites out of our brains, and so she has a plan. I can't remember what it was. Oh, I wrote, let's see, I did think I write it down. Oh. We have to find a crash, I think. And we don't know what, it, she was ambiguous about what a crash is. She said it can be many things. It sounded like an encampment or a bunch of her people uh, might be um, um, the, uh, the, the, the Gith Yankees. Is that is that what she is? A Gith, Gith Yankee? And she mentioned a guy named Augusto? and Zoru. So apparently those doing that, I think is, we have to eventually get to Zoru and get this parasite out of our heads. Um, so that is where we left off. Oh, and I figured out how to make a camp. So we were in the camp. Yeah. So, uh, let me get my big head out of here. And, oh, um, KD 
and uh, Noxio, uh, you need to uh, contact me um, through the um, the email address there on the on the home page, and let me know uh, what platform you you play on. You know whether it's PC or console. You know which one, and so that and let's uh, let's get those game those free uh, games to you. Congratulations again. So um, right now we'll take a quick break. You know, smoke them if you got them. Or go eat some chocolate candy if you don't smoke them. And uh, <laughs> we'll have some M&Ms or something. And I'll be right back at you in just a few minutes. All right, I'm back. All right, all right. Now, um, this says I've completed 25%. It says game progress, 25%. Um, <laughs> Um, I've only put out two episodes, I, you know, this is episode three. Um, all right, so, okay, 25%. View activity, new acti new activity, act three. Kill the remaining chosen and take their nether stone. Well, I don't think we're in act three yet. Um... And I don't know who the chosen are. We saw uh, a couple of people roaming around um, the ruins as I, we were trying to find Lazelle, Lazelle. And we heard a bunch of noise, a bunch of shouting coming. I, those are goblins, I think, off to the, the left over there. I avoided them because there was a bunch of them. So I think we'll go after the, these guys down here in the ruins that we saw. I only saw two of them. And um, maybe we'll do that. I don't think we're in chapter three. Now, this is not a how-to uh, walkthrough or a where to find this, that, and the other thing. This is a old man blind playing <laughs> okay just so you know in case you don't I know nothing about this game everything I know about this game is what you saw in episode one and episode two and I'm playing on a, a system I'm unfamiliar with PlayStation 5 so there's a lot of fumbling and bumbling and going on just trying to figure out the mechanics And, um, and so it's just, uh, I'm doing this because a lot of people from the Red Dead 2 community uh, wanted to see it next after, you know, I, I um, completed Red Dead 2. You don't complete Red Dead 2, but got all the way through and, and into the epilogue there. Wow. Man. Uh, so first impressions are um, A plus, A plus. That if you want my impression. So we're in camp, and I wanted to unload a bunch of the gear. I mean, a bunch of the loot that I'm carrying. Look at Blazel. She's got like uh, stuff swirling around her her feet and her her waist and she's got that flaming sword we got from that uh, that guy in the Naughty Lloyd the, uh, the boss what was his name Zelk Zalk something like that not enough space well I'm already there dude so there's enough space for me all right so um, to view the map how do I view the map um, I think we go here yeah. So is this? That's a magic mirror. Okay, that's part of our camp. Um, what I want to know is now we had. So we're here. We found Lazel here. We found um, Asterion over here, the vampire, right? We crashed the ship right here. We found Gale. I don't know where we found Gale. I think over here somewhere. Maybe it was over here. Anyway, there were some ruins 
So Lazelle was here, and we come through here. I think we're right on the ruins. Yeah, we are, well. Because we came through here. The ruins were over here somewhere. Um, and I saw a couple of people. And then we heard a whole bunch of shouting and noise from goblins up this way. Okay. You cannot fast travel right now. <laughs> okay. I have no intentions. So basically, it looks like we've got this part all opened up. I don't see any. And so we're going to be heading north. But first... I want to go. I don't want to go after these guys because there was a whole bunch of them up here, and uh, I saw just a couple of them down here in those ruins. Place marker, zoom, center, close. All right, so that's what uh, I'll go look for those guys, and we'll get into a fight. I want to. I want an easy fight to start with. I'll be right back at you here. I'm just gonna. Um, I got to figure out how to unload my stuff, the loot I'm carrying. And how to select the people we're bringing with us. Uh, definitely bringing um, Lazelle because she's got that sword, and um, and I want to bring the two new people because we haven't used them yet. So Asterion and um, Gale, and so that means Shadowheart. And I hate to not have her with us because I'm I'm used to uh, well you know the first battles we had over on the Naughty Lloyd, um, she was very useful. And I don't know what the two new guys can do. But that that's what I'm going to bring with me. And uh, I'll start recording once I figure out how to select who's... Oh, there, right over here. So it looks like I've got the party I want. So all I need to do is unload the uh, loot I don't want. You know, store it. And uh, break camp. Figure out how to break camp and head on out. And um, Gale only has 14 health. Well, he's so he's he, he relies on on doing stuff from afar, right? Well, so well, so do we all. <laughs> None of us have a whole lot of uh, HP. All right, let me. I don't want to waste your time watching me fumble around trying to get stuff stored and break in camp because I'm not even sure how to break camp. All right, man. I'm. I'm pick up recording here in just a couple minutes and we'll go pick a fight that's my plan well I can't figure out how to leave camp <clears throat> I've already done the uh, let's see right here leave camp it won't let me I've already done a long rest I mean we've already rested it won't let me leave camp. Um, so we have to find Nettie. I didn't write that down. Um, there's a camp nearby. But I don't know how to leave camp. Uh, how do I leave camp? I mean, I can't figure it out. Pick up, exam, examine, that's a candle. Um, I can't, I can't figure out how to get out of camp. I mean, the thing that lets you do that won't let me do it. I don't want to take another long rest and use up more supplies and just be in the same boat. Um, you know, so this is what I stored. Um, just to get off of, uh, get it off of him, lighten his load a little bit. But I don't see any way to. Um, I see a way to break camp. Um, you know how to break camp, dude? Um, I guess 
Yankee joining our company. What a collaboration I'd have anticipated, but a welcome one nonetheless. Tell me a bit more about yourself. My memories of the non-light are shrouded in darkness. Memory loss isn't usually a symptom of seromorphosis. If it is, they've forgotten to write it down in any text I've read on the subject. Then again, our case isn't exactly usual. Perhaps whatever's causing our tadpoles to remain in stasis has also affected your mind. If seromorphosis takes place, all trace of your former self will be subsumed into the Mind Flayer's hive. So, to still be here, if I might forgetful, still a win in my book. Okay, so I'm the only one experiencing that. Let's see. I hail from Waterdeep, City of Splendors. I am a wizard of considerable acclaim and scholar of exceptional accomplishment. <laughs> and I humble. Have a cat, a library, and a weakness for a good glass of wine. And if the mood takes me, I'm known to try my hand at poetry. Well. Yeah. There. Don't stop there. You must have many stories. I don't want to know more about your hobbies. Can't you tell me something about the real you? Certainly. That I have a great respect for privacy, for instance, <laughs> especially my own. Gotcha. I'm out. Try peering into his mind. If he won't open up, you'll sneak in. Uh, let's change the subject right now. Because I need, I need to leave camp. I, I just wanted, I want somebody to tell me how to get out of here because it won't let me. If I do this again, we're going to use up more supplies. And I'm going to be right back here because I just did this. You know what I mean? I just took a long rest, and here's here we are. Um, Speak. <laughs> Seromorphosis takes all of you. Mind, body, soul. An ordinary tadpole would eat at your memories until they were lost to the void. But our tadpoles are far from ordinary. I wonder if another factor's in play. Yeah? I understand much beyond your comprehension. More to the point, I know the cure for our condition. It is imperative we locate a crash. You do well to observe more and question less. Oh, okay, fine. Do you know what happens if we don't? Yeah, we already know. Many a good warrior savors the scent of blood in the air. There's no shame in a capricious murder now and again. Too many, though. And you waste energy and dull your weapon. My suggestion. Attack with purpose and savor your kills. And if the urge proves too much, well, I'm sure we can find you a goblin or two to carve up. I like her. Uh, I need not. Okay, so apparently I did not take a long rest. Even though I ended last episode, I selected long rest after I <clears throat> made camp but there was something else you're supposed to do I you can't just select it long rest I thought that would give us a long rest but there's uh, two more things you got to press so the triangle the Y or something now how do we completely break camp so in the party we've got okay those are the four I want um, I want to make sure everybody has long strider on them. Might as well put it on myself, right? Okay, she's coming. coming. We are leaving 
shadow heart reluctantly behind, cannot reach. Okay, now how do we get out of camp? <laughs> ah! Do we pack up? What happened? I just did something stupid. Um, <clears throat> no, I did not do something stupid. All right. One, two, three, four. Um, hey. Are you not coming with us? Group? Okay. So, okay, there's a couple of things. We got goblin noises over that away, and a whole bunch of goblins. And I saw just a couple of people um, down where? down map. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. The, aha! Good. This is where we can find the healer Nettie. And this is where we can... Ah! <clears throat> so this is where the Geth Yankee crash, crash, crash there is for Zoru. Zoru is the one. So Neti. One of these two can remove the uh, the worm. I did not. Well, that's a gate that we we um, could not open. There was a, 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 a buried a chest that over here somewhere, and we didn't have the shovel for it, but we picked the shovel up over here somewhere, and we did dig up one over here, and there's another chest down here, uh, I think. A boat. Do I want to pick it up? Well, it does what our bows do. This was the way we went and we dug up something. And then we heard all that, all the voices. There was a bunch of commotion. Is everybody with me? Yes. Um, and there were broken traps. Somewhere over here. Somewhere there was a, a buried chest. Waypoint discovered. Okay, I did not go this way. Aha! So we can use this. I don't. Um, um, context menu. Sir Galahad. Um, examine. I don't want to click on this and travel somewhere by accident. I won't stay right in here. If I, what happens when you, what happens when you use it? Oh, I can fast travel anywhere. Okay. Well, anywhere that we have waypoints to. Whoa! Gorgeous. Okay. So, okay. Is there a way, like, to examine your your surroundings? Um, and you know there was I can't remember it seemed like I was able to um, look around for stuff I can't remember we don't need that boat I, is that a thing that's a thing I examine it Elixir of Resistance. Combine three. Okay, let's uh, grab it. Nice. 
case. We don't need the bow. Anything else around here we can pick up? Talk. Um, okay. There was another mound, a dirt mound, that indicated that there would be a treasure chest under it. Oh, hey. This. I think this is where I saw some people. Um, we came up from that side over here. I saw some heads in here, some people moving around. There's one, there's two right there. All right, let's sneak. You'll die a bloody pauper unless you take a few risks. But I'm not hearing their voices. 10 XP. Chapel entrance. Okay, they can't see us, so... Um, you can only see where they're facing, right? And leave us now. I hear voices. I haven't seen anyone but us. It's just wilderness out here. Turn it up. So there's a rock right over that guy. Let's um Let's shoot it down. If I can, can I not? You both twice as tall as me, but I'm half the bloody backbone. But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? Well, they don't I'm seem like you, real bad it's a guys. Ship. And the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in. For wait days. a minute. Now we stop. Got ourselves competition already. That's our ship. I was trying to sneak up on him. Um, I wanted to shoot that rock. Uh, I don't want to hurt you, but provoke me and I'll keep stabbing long after you're dead. I'm not competition. I'm annihilation. I mean, no harm. Just looking around. No, no, no. Persuasion. That ship's full of monsters. I wouldn't go near it. Deception. I think that ship's an invasion force. Run while you can. The only thing you own is your life. Leave before I take that too. Uh, or just attack them. Well, he's good at persuasion and deception, right? That's where Galahad is. I'm not competition. I'm annihilation. I like it. <laughs> Strength. Okay, so he's not big on strength. He is big on persuasion. He's big on deception too, isn't he? Um, my guy. Oh, we got to roll a 12. Uh -oh. Ten plus. We got it. So these these guys are gonna boogie on out of here. Well, uh, in that case, come on, you lot. No point in getting killed. Second worm gets the cheese and all. Um, I wanted to fight mouse though. Gets the cheese, no? <laughs> Nobody's getting any damn cheese. Now move it. They all run. Incredible. Sir Galahad uh, made a successful save. Um, oh, we don't want that thing falling on us. Um, so now we can't loot. Or can we? Open. Nothing in it. Uh, Stay away from those. Whoa, whoa, stay away from that. You don't want to fall in a hole. Use. Time and the elements have left the plaque unreadable. Well, that's no help. Can I? Yeah, see, I wanted to shoot that thing down. I would have killed one of them. Ah, we've been here. We came in. This is where I saw them the first time. I saw their heads in here. 
There was four of them. I didn't realize there was four of them. All right. I think down that way was where the, the chest was, but let's not step on the hole. Let's see if there's anything up here of value. So what the heck were they trying to steal? They were trying to steal something. <laughs> Open it. Ah! Fish and horseradish. <laughs> so that's the only thing here? Well, there's that door. Um... Chapel entrance. I can't jump down. Okay. There was a pit. There was a dig upable. Oh, this is one of those broken traps. Not much use anymore. Not much use anymore. Not much use anymore. Well, can I like? Oh, that's how you search the area. Smashed cave. Actions. You, Sir Galahad. Not much use anymore. Okay. So holding down X. That was how we did it. Aha! A trap. A torn trap. Um, you, Sir Galahad. Not much use anymore. So it's no good. Not much use anymore. So we got to be careful about stepping into this stuff. I swear there was another dig upable thing over here. Um, all right. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I wanted... Oh, wait a minute. Did that light up? No. I wanted a fight. We've cleared the wreckage. done all of that. Oh, we'd have to uh, jump that, huh? We would take fire damage. Let's not take fire damage. Um, well, that was weird that he couldn't, uh, he couldn't jump down that little step. I wanted to fight those guys, dang it. We got spotted. And, okay, this is, I think this gets us around. Is this the dig upable thing? Did we already dig it up? Um, R1. Do I have a dig option? Yeah. Nothing interesting buried here. Okay. I think we dug, that's the one we dug up. There was another one that I saw, and we didn't have the shovel. Um, that's the way to the... Is this where the fire block was? Aha! 
It's empty. This is the one we dug up. There's the voices. Okay, well, I wanted a fight. I think we're about to get one. Open the bloody gate! Nobody gets in! Zevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins. goblins are on our tail! Open the gate, Zevlor, now! You let goblins hear? Where is the druid? Please! There's no time! Uh-oh. No, no! Here we go. I wanted to fight. By the nine hells! Open the gate! However, I would like it to be on my terms, not theirs. Trapped outside. Shit. Form a line. Damnable roach. Who's this? Provoke the blade. I like him. And <laughs> suffer it sting. Yeah. Okay, we're in a fight. I can't go into um turn base, can I? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah. Um, where are the bad guys at? Uh, where are the targets? These guys. So we can flank them. Is that the deal? Ah. And it's um, a stereon who goes first. Not enough movement. Health, 26, 13, 27, 9. Okay. We got to help these guys. Oh, Lord. Um, oh, we got some up here. Well, he has a 65% chance on him. On either one of him, them. Uh, let's get him up to some high ground. And take this guy 65%. Um, let's try. Let's do it. <laughs> Critical on the second. Um, what else can he do? What does this do? Knock someone unconscious. Did I just turn it on or did I turn it off? Ah! I can't do anything else. Okay. So I need to catch my breath. It's up to me. I got a 55 on that sucker, but I want this sucker. We want him dead so he doesn't come at a sterian. These are bowmen. Um, I have options though. Let's see. Dissonant whispers. Frighten a creature. Knocks him down. Last ten turns. Sixty-five. I want this beast down. Sixty. I want the other big dude down. 60. It's not a very... Those aren't good odds. 65. Okay, let's try something else. Um, that only does 4 to 9. Disadvantage. Disadvantage. All right. Um, can 
Can I jump? Somewhere to get advantage? Now, <laughs> what? Disadvantage. Disadvantage. High defense. Ranged attack. Ranged attack. Four to nine. Um, Sixty. Man, I just doesn't have a real good chance. This sucker has twenty six health. This sucker has twenty seven health. Let's try it. It worked. guys. Okay. We're all right. Oh, gosh. He's got that ability, too. Aha! Nice. Crit critical miss. It said critical miss. Uh, what does that mean? I got critically hit, but a miss? Okay, you guys are pretty good. They're pretty good. All right. Can she end one of these suckers? 65. Um, we really need to get rid of these guys. Um, shoot. Um, was not prepared for this, obviously. Um, jump. Let's get some um, advantage here. Some height advantage. One to ten, two to sixteen. Sleep, I like that. Ah, here it is. This isn't bad either. Right here, magic missile. Hundred percent. We need to start working on that guy. Can kill this one outright. This thing's going to have a turn coming up real soon. Let's get it. Only did two? Dude. suck well. We need him to do something really good. Not enough movement. Not enough movement. What attacks does he have? Uh, 
1 to 10 firebolt, 5 to 15. He only has a 65% chance of hitting this guy. And he missed the boat. Ah, sheesh, dude. Let's go. Ah, okay, this is me. 70%. 85%. This guy's almost gone, too. Um, I think... Not that good of an attacker. Uh, four to eleven. Four to nine. It's out of range. Seventy. Eighty-five. I think we go right here. Bardic inspiration. that helps her or not. Not sure what it does. You guys need to do a little better for me here. Need a little more help out of you guys. Uh oh. Missed me. Now you gotta kiss me. Ow! This dude has really good evasive skills. 75, 60. Well, she can end this sucker. Mm. If she hits. We need to start working on this guy. Taste my fury. <laughs> no, girl. Not supposed to do that. She has to move. Uh, um, can we loot him? Um, Good try. It worked. I don't think she can move far. Let's move her back as much as we can. Um, a magic missile did not hit hard. That didn't hit hard either. Well, I hit hard, but that sucker's still alive. Um, what's this do? Dip? Shove. 
jump. Keep him right where he is. Ah, good, it missed. Ah, that's not good. Ah, can you end one of these dudes for me, please? Um. Um, can you end this guy? Please. Gets him for one. <clears throat> That's all he can do. And he's hurt. Survival is all that matters. 80%. something good I can do here. Dissonant Whispers. Try this again. We gotta get this guy knocked down. chance second wind girl miss she had a 90 this dude out over here. He's fighting up. That guy's got 11 left on him. So this is magic attacks. Uh, Barth is a bad guy, right? He's, he's not one of ours, is he? I don't know who the bad guys are. If it doesn't do enough damage. Um... have advantage. Main hand attack 65 again. Finally? Um...
choice but to keep going. Seventy-five percent. A ranged attack. He's out of range of me. Wakes up. Crap. Oh, that sucked. That's good. Did you kill it? Ah, uh, that's me? Are these, are these are our guys? Is this the last thing? Is this the last enemy? I believe it is. 65. Um... Is this guy a bad guy? Green hand attack. Worth examining. Kill some guys over here. Kill some guys up top. <laughs> well, we better get inside the gate, I guess. inside the gate. Emerald Cove. There are children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! Where there's one goblin, there's ten. I'm leaving before the horde shows up. One fight just ended, now you're picking another one. Relax, Druid. Those goblins didn't take any prisoners. You can cough up my payment any time now. <clears throat> What's unbelievable is how we beat the goblins. You're both heroes.
we have to beat a 15? Oh. Uh-oh. We failed. Tell that to the dead at the gate. Shut it, horns. I'd be lying dead next Shut to the Shut it, horns. Any longer. My duty is to this camp. Oh, God forbid you risk your precious tail. But I shouldn't be surprised. Foul bloods ain't known for courage. Okay, we gotta see the tiefling's jaw clench. He's about to erupt. Stand back and watch. Well, we have to defuse this. Again with the 15. Nine, no chance. 14. I tried. I tried to defuse it. Should have done that a long time ago. Arrogant prick had it out for me from day one. <laughs> no one leaves my people out cold. I'm with you, man. I was trying. You put him in a bind showing up like that, and he did try to open the gate. So you knocked him cold instead. Clever. Too little, too late. He was right, though. Coming back to this hellhole was a mistake no amount of gold can put right. I'd rather face another round of goblins than stay in this pit. Um, so what just happened? They're leaving? Where's that real good fighter dude? Can I close this gate? Apparently not. I don't think that went very well. I should have expected that. Are you all right? You had that coming. Better than further bloodshed. I'll survive a sore jaw. Particularly if it's rid the grove of Aradin. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. Druids. I have no quarrel with druids. Why are they forcing you out? There have been several attacks by different monsters. The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Nobody's welcome anymore. They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay. But we'll be slaughtered if we leave. Okay. We are no fighters. So they want to cut this area off. We want to keep it open, I think. I need a healer. The ritual. Is there no way to convince the druids to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though. I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Interesting. Perhaps you could persuade her. Yeah, maybe. For more time to prepare, if nothing else. I want to try and help. I'll do what I can. My head's a wreck. <laughs> I, I've got too much else to do with right now. Perhaps if you could help me find a healer. What are you offering for my aid? We owe you a great debt. What little we have, we'll scrape together. It isn't coin we need. It's time. Goblin got you. The druid Halsin's a renowned healer, but he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition. If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice Nettie. She's with the other druids in the inner grove. They've withdrawn there to prepare this damn ritual of theirs. 
Well, that's what we came here for, more or less. I'll find her and I'll speak to Kaga. Kaga. We're messengers. Disapproved. Disapproved. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please make them see sense before more lives are lost. Well, I thought I was doing good, but I guess not. Okay. So now, what? What I do? What I do? Emerald Grove is where we are. Find a way into the ruins. Good luck with that. Um, and we've got those opened up. And we're here. We're here. Emerald Grove is what they're trying to cut off. I'm so confused. Um, not really. There's something inside here. Can we, can I jump? I can open it. I don't want to say it. I want, I want to, I want to open it. I'll take the potato. I'll take that. I'm hoping there's a place to sell all this um, armor and stuff that we we won't be. Oh, look out! That looks like a nice place. Let's uh, the hollow. All right. Refugees, adventurers. No one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Are you really locking down the grove? I know it's drastic, but more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. What do you sell? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Ha! Bits and bobs, eh? Resistance. Thunder arrows. Lightning arrow. I don't like them. Um, you know what? I'm going to ask for advice and then they have. Sylvanas, guide your path. Uh, wait, no, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy stuff from you, dude. But I'm going to end the episode here and ask for advice from y'all. Uh, can I make camp here? I wonder. Uh, if I go to camp, am I going to be outside or inside? Um, let's go to camp. Am I going to be able to camp here with them? No! Where'd it do? Put me outside? Where'd it put me? Oh, it's the same old camp that we always have. Um, okay, um, long rest. And, um, someone in camp wishes to speak to me. Well, I'll tell you what we'll do. Um, we'll save it. episode and this is fun uh, so I think I kind of got us in a mess there a couple of people didn't like the idea of becoming messengers and uh, Gail and uh, no it was um, 
Lizelle and Asteria didn't like that. Now, I don't think I do either. I didn't mean to step in that. Uh, we still need to get Natty, so we're finding out some stuff. Uh, finding out we're not very good fighters. <laughs> I didn't want to uh, chase off those that first group. I wanted to fight them just for the XP and, and the loot on them, but somehow they saw us. Anyway, uh, it's fun. So much, uh, so much uh, to do. So much to uh, absorb and learn. Well, thank you all for watching. I, I do appreciate it. Y'all take care of yourselves. We'll see you on the next episode.